Hey guys, it's Alex here, and all I gotta say is if you enjoy this speed run, please smack the like button, and I hope you enjoy. We need to get to the bridge. From there, we can use the captain's neural implants to initiate an overload of the ship's fusion engines. The explosion should damage enough systems below it to destroy the ring. is located next to the main view screen. The ship was heavily damaged when it crashed. Head to the cryo chamber. You should be able to get to the engine room through there. Good! The 
Step one complete. We have a straight shot into the fusion reactor. We need a catalyst explosion to destabilize the magnetic containment field surrounding the fusion cells. Use an explosive. I recommend a grenade or rocket. If you run out of explosives, there is an armory station located near the engine room's entrance. Analyze it. Fusion reactor number one destabilizing. Use explosives on the other three reactors. That should be enough to trigger a wildcat explosion of the engine. Reactor to go. That did it. The engine's gone critical. Based on the current rate of decay, we should have 15 minutes to get off the ship. We don't have much time. We should move outside and signal for evac. Accessing schematics. There's a service lift at the top of the engine room. It leads to a Class 7 service corridor that runs along the ship's dorsal structure. Hurry!
Stop! This is where Fohammer is coming to pick us up. Hold position here. Cortana to Echo 419. Two Covenant Banshees are approaching on your six. Evade! Say again, evade! I Calculating alternate escape route. Ship's inventory shows one long sword.